Well, fuck, that's gonna have to be... fixed. Uh, probably gonna have to chop around that. There will be a brief segment where I can't say anything because... Did not get his gloves. But yeah, there's gonna be a brief segment where I cut out because... I just dropped my headset. And it would be very loud. Uh, who is someone there? Oh. The dark surround little creatures, so please. Hot. I wish I had Morn's Gauntlet so I can do the thing. There you are. So close, and I am praise. Get the prayer. Now sell me miracles. Oh, I am. If I came to this land. Your touch has freed me from the darkness. I am weak, but if it would not. Oh, sure. Thank you, sweet. I also hot. Because when you could buy miracles from her in that location before. Maybe I'm misremembering. But anyways. Uh, I want to get to Sigurd. Oh, you know what? I probably trade in uh, sunlight tokens at the altar of sunlight in this game. Four pronged paw. Pretty sure you just had to get that from farming before. Speaking of, do I really want to stay in the way of light for these upgrade materials? I mean, I haven't found them in any location is the issue. To be fair, I'll probably find a place where I can grind them up. Uh, how do I get to the area? I think I need to go back. Can I get up from here? Yeah, yeah, wait. No? Maybe? What I'm trying to do is get over to the area where I drop down and near the tower. Oh, I have a really distorted sense of 3D space in this game. I have no idea what direction I even want to go. I think it's over there. But I'm not sure. I guess what I'm gonna do is uh, run back through the giant arrow segment. Because I know how to go go there from there. So isn't the giant like around here somewhere? Ah. I'm very lost. Alright, all the enemies are back. Oh, I got an invasion. Here we go. What an awful time for it, too. I don't have an upgraded weapon. I <laughs> don't have a particularly good uh, setup. Let's see if I can actually win this. Dragon Eye. Oh, you know what it is? That's interesting. It seems like the... Uh, seems like the Covenant items affect all players in the world, so if you got, like, a few buddies in here, you could come up with all of your, uh, Covenants being the same and just get a ton of Covenant items. Where are you, dude? We can't... Wait, what? She's dead. So, oh, I guess he's probably up here. And killed her with range. I'm not a dick invader. I'm not gonna try and actually gank this dude. Yeah, this guy's dead. How the fuck? Oh, he must have dropped off the side after killing her. I'm trying to reverse engineer what this man did is surprisingly interesting. Oh, well, blue phantom's right here. Hello, blue. What is he doing? 
Oh, lag switch. I will fight you, Blue. Come on down here. I don't. In I don't intend to walk under you. Or fight the host. Come on. Now, did you think that was ever going to work? Wait, what is he getting hit by? I think we're terribly desynced. Now go wherever you want to go, dude. And that's the hollow sword. Oh, this guy has no health. Yeah, that that's that's how quickly that's over. I think a mad servant came in because it showed both our no, it's just another blue. This guy is... Wait, no. I'm in Cinder's mod. He must know what I'm doing. I'm in the Cinder's... Oh, so you're healing. That's the, that's the point we've come to. Well, unfortunately for you, I have regen armor. Get some stamina. He has way more health. He is really efficient for that parry. for this to become the Blue Slayer episode, but... Oh, does... I don't... I don't get that... that same, uh... heavy power attack if I'm not in Warcry. You really just gonna sit there chugging? You will run out of Estus eventually. I have infinite mana, dude. You should know this. me trying to use a spell with no FP. I think he parried one of the enemies. And it's clear that he's made himself immune to their attacks. Oh, somebody popped a... Somebody finally popped a... What is it called? A seed of a giant tree. So now I can fight the enemies here, which should be fine. <laughs> you want to chug? I'll show you how to chug. Oh, the host is here finally, and he's using that. He's using that, which tells me immediately that this guy is not supposed to be here. Okay, so rapid fire does seem to be the only benefit of that uh, spell now, because it is definitely not doing anything else. Yeah, okay, that hit. Yep. Okay. C yeah, congratulations. 
I have a hard time feeling like you outplayed me when you sat there waiting for minutes on end for the host to come here. Host popped a seed of a giant tree and was using a spell that isn't accessible till later in the game. Like, congratulations, you have outplayed me. Let's get back to the normal game now. I don't know if I actually have to kill the host to get the uh, quest progression. I hope I don't. Anyways. Oh, all the enemies are still going to be here. Wait. Oh, my souls are here because that's where I died as a red phantom. Eh. I really don't want to fight through all these enemies, but... Ain't got much of a choice. Still way easier than trying to fight all those enemies. Like I guess more things change, more thing more they stay the same. Blues are OP. Posts have an overwhelming advantage to kill invaders in this game. <laughs> I'm neither meta building or using any of the strats that actually make it possible to gank spank. Or at least, the strats that existed previously. I have no idea if they still work. Used to be you basically had to insta kill the host or be able to poke ad infinitum to actually beat invasions gang squads he puts on big item glow for five fading souls for some reason I don't think it's actually any enemies in this room no there's just the one trap god this weapon sucks it's moveset sucks I love it's theme I do wonder, though, who goes into the Cinders mod and decides to use the goddamn Hollow Slayer Greatsword? Sweat, uh, sweaty guys, I guess, but... You'd really think you'd have more of a sense of wonder and fun in a mod this expansive. So... That's how you get over there. Am I tripping and I've run and I've ran in a giant circle for no goddamn reason because I have because to get to the Siegward area I have to go through that tower? That is a distinct possibility. That I've run in a giant ass circle for no reason. But whatever, I got my invasion because of it. Oh, there's a lot of stun frames on that. Warcry weapons never saw so any major use in the meta, so I don't know if they're just bad. Or if they can be fixed, or... That's not true, there was the uh, machetes. The machetes sound some use. And they have a f uh, the giant machetes, uh, Yorms and the traditional variant. One has sharpen, not which is, like, specifically not Warcry, but it effectively works like Warcry. Oh, and that doesn't have a ring anymore. But they saw some use, and... Yeah, I think that's it. Do I just have to die? No, I can fall down here. And get back over here.
TLDR, I'm not sure if this weapon is awful because Warcry or if it's good because DLC. In any case, I think I'm just going to go kill the uh, giant tree thing. No, that would be stupid. I should go open the door first. If I, kill, if I kill the curse rotted great wood, then I won't be able to get back up. But I hope you like your uh, running around extra pointless today because god damn I'm misremembering a ton of th stuff about this game. Where'd that corpse come from? I don't remember killing one right here. Maybe I did. But anyways, I wonder if they moved the uh, Irithyll Soldier. That's the name of the place. The icy place. No, no, no. Welcome, Onion Boy! Your first appearance. Very hmm. Oh, pardon me. I am, to be honest, have Blah 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 blah. This lip with a lip. This with. Imagine an idiot who's never rolled past the lift after hitting it. I hope they don't make me fight two Irithyll soldiers in this area. Ah, they fucking do. What did he just do? Wave dash at me? Fuck. Fuck. Okay. Okay. I can't afford to get it. No. Fuck. Wait. He has so little health comparatively. Play lame. Lose. Okay. Okay. Irithyll. What? What? And chug, chug, chug. This is a, this is a notoriously uh, chuggy area, anyway. So, so I can't blame the mod too much for these slideshow presentations. Jesus Christ! Is my game gonna crash again? It better not crash again. Okay, okay, we're good. Let's walk away from the loading zone. Ah, oh, that is the Claymore moveset. Yep. It's a lot of stamina. Oh! Oh, shit, this is the uh, Hollow Knight. Hollow Slayer Greatsword. And it's got stance. It's got full stance. Ah. Oh. Ah, oh, what is the scale with? It's a Dex Greatsword. Ugh. Do I want <laughs> to dedicate my build to using this awesome weapon? Ah, uh, I think I do. Next level up, I'm putting some points into decks. Let's get this on shit online. For now, though, goodbye, Tonatrice. You were awful. You sucked. But I love you. If and when I go back into a dedicated build and start playing PvP again, I will definitely do some Tantras PvP. Oops. Shiv. For some reason, that's sticking out to me. Was it not? Was there not a game weapon called Shiv in the base game? No, it's not. It's a enemy weapon. The daggers that uh, thralls use. <laughs> 